This is the book of Job, chapter 38, verse 3. Gird up now thy loins like a man, for I will demand of thee, and answer thou me. The black male needs to pick up and decide to put these black chicks in their place. Mm. Mm. Yes, sir. 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 Well, let me hold that thought. Let me order this food real quick. Oh, to wrestle the black female and tell her and put her in her place. Eat. Because if you don't, you're just going to do, you know. Right. She's just going to, I don't know, she's just going to, she's just going to, you know, mess it all up. Why is the black woman going to mess it up? Shalom, Shalom, Kahalah, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Raka Kodash. I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone who teach in Ruel. Peace and salutations to the whole four elect scattered abroad. My name is Abar from the Prophets in Babylon camp. And um, in this video you see right here on the screen, you know, though it may sound a little you know, frustrating or, um, you know, uh, maybe make you feel some type of way to hear it coming from who it's coming from. This woman is, as, as, hey man, she's right. You know, she's, abs she's absolutely right. You see, because at some point in time, the Israelite man is going to have to be a man and stand up and be accountable, you know. And really, you know, the way we do that is by going out and first you have to, you know, Get this word for yourself. Get 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 this edification, okay. And then we have to go and rebuke our nation, okay. The wicked of our nation, man. And it just so happened to be the majority of our nation are women, okay. And the so-called black woman Eve is out of control, you see. And this is why we have to, as a man, you you know, over your nation, you pull to put your woman in check. You know, it's any nation, you see. Because the Most High really is not dealing with black men and black women. He's dealing with the Israelite men and Israelite women, okay? So it's our job as Israelite men to bring our women back into the understanding of what it means to be an Israelite woman and not a black woman, okay? Bring our children into the understanding of what it means to be an Israelite instead of a, 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 a black person, okay? Because black is, there's, there's no nation called black, okay? Black means void of light. Darkness, evil, okay? That's a byword that was put upon us by the devil, you see? And our people have taken that byword, and they have, you know, taken, you know, pretty much ran with it, man. Now they talk about black culture, okay? And in black culture, it's a bunch of, you know, wickedness, adultery, you know, just disgusting bullshit, man. You know, you got um the LGBT community, a big part of it, you know? A bunch of wickedness, man. Okay, and what Jake think is that it's okay for them to, you know, be in this light, okay, or live this type of life, these these, these type of lives because of, you know, slavery or whatever or whatever else it may be. But in reality, no, we this is you know a, a, a calling for us to come back to the Most High. And what this woman is saying is very spiritual because it's the truth. And you're gonna hear this man's emotional weak response, okay. But it's in Psalm chapter 94, verse 16. Who will rise up for me against the evildoers? Who will stand up for me against the workers of iniquity? And our people are working iniquity, okay? They're working iniquity, man. And, you know, as a man, we're supposed to go out there and, you know, um, show our people their transgressions, man, Okay? Because at the end of the day, at the end of the day, you know, the Lord called us to be watchmen and to go to and, and to, you know, to pretty much give warning, you see, to our people so that they don't be destroyed. That's that, that that's our that's that's our job. You see, to go out there and warn Jacob so they don't be destroyed because the Lord is about to destroy so those our people. You see, and it takes a, it, it's the Israelite man that's supposed to stop getting so emotionally, 
you know, these guys are emotional, man. These guys are scared of these women. These guys worship the, the, the damn woman. The black woman is God. That's one of these, the black woman is God, niggas. You see? Isaiah chapter 58, verse 1. And now this, now, don't, don't get me wrong, this woman might have been saying this out, out, out of a malice heart or intentions, but in reality what she said was the truth, though, man. You know, speaking from the outside looking in, you know, hey, the Israelite man has to stand up, man. You know, get your nuts out of her purse. All right, it's time to man up. It's time to, you know, become men. All right, leaders. Okay, stop allowing these women to lead you. You know, you 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 supposed to be the one leading the woman because whenever a woman leads, she gonna lead you to destruction, man. The 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 the, the, the Lord is dealing with the men, so you got to come back to the Most High God in truth and sincerity, getting the right doctrine, getting the right understanding, and then lead your family likewise, man. And then what's that gonna do if you you know put your wife in order? Then what what happened? Then then, then you're then your um, then your uh, children are gonna be in order. Isaiah chapter fifty-eight verse one: Cry aloud, spare not; lift up thy voice like a trumpet, and show my people their transgressions, and the house of Jacob their sins. So it's our job, being Israelite men, to show our people their transgressions and the house of Jacob their sins. And he said to cry aloud and spare not. You know we ain't supposed to be sparing feelings here, man. You know you can't get emotional about this, man. You see, she's talking about the black woman being out of order, and she's absolutely right. And if your mom, or your sister, your girlfriend is out of order, and she a she a black woman that's out of order, then that 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 goes even more to show why you got to ace hey, stand up, man. First, for, but first you got to get yourself in order, man. Okay, that's the first thing. See, because order is important in this thing, man. The scripture says that let all things be done decently and in order. Okay. All things must be done decently and in order. And, the, 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 you know, the, the big part of that um, is, you know, starting first and foremost with yourself and then your immediate household, you know, whether you have women and children, and then going out there and teaching your, 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 your uh, people, man. Second Ezra chapter, 5, chapter 14, verse 13. Now, therefore, set thine house in order and uh, reprove thy people. P comfort. Such of them as be in trouble and now renounce corruption. This is our job as Israelite men, as men in general, man. You know, but even more so as Israelite men. I'm going to bring this back. Now, therefore, set thine house in order, meaning set your house in order, meaning your, yeah, your woman, your children. Show them who the Lord is. Show tell them what's coming. You know, when she learned this truth, that's one of the first things you better supposed to go do. You know, it's, it's set your house in order. You know, once you become established in this word and then done your due diligence and studied and know that this is the truth. You know, you, scriptures talk about being um, fully persuaded in, in your own mind. Then you need to go and, you know, and teach your, your uh, you know, your, your uh, family, you know, some some of your, your, your friends, you know, and, and you know, try to help to try, try to help, 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 help them get it set in your house in order and reprove thy people. So we got to reprove our people, man. This thing ain't about, on just ain't about you know big and Jake up you know, oh yeah we 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 the chosen people we a holy nation, you know, we the greatest people on the earth, but at the same time we are in wickedness right now we are going against our 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 our, our um power right now man, our people don't know who they are right now, okay so we gotta reprove the thy people, comfort such of them as be in trouble and now renounce corruption. Well, the color of her skin, you know, people like porcelain skin, the blue eyes, the yellow hair, you know, all of it. You want to go there? I'm asking you. I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. First of all, our black women are strong. And he's talking, and she was talking about how they wearing the the the, the blonde hair and the, the 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 blue contacts, and you know. Bleaching their skin and stuff, man. Cause that's what, I, that's what our, our, our women are doing, you know. Getting all these, um, you know, um, uh, what is it? Um, surgeries, I guess you could say. You know, plastic surgeries. 
you see to try to you know look and and and, and pretty much they're envying the so-called white woman you see and really the, the so-called white woman envy the so-called black woman i know that you got strong black women in this world yes indeed now this man said we have strong black women and what our people don't realize is a woman is not supposed to be strong you see for grown ass men to be saying we got strong black women a woman's fit, you know, fit, fit physical attributes aren't supposed to be strong a woman's supposed to be feminine compassionate caring you know um, you know comforting man you know not some strong big black bitch that you know talking about how she, how she gonna beat your ass because you looked at her wrong okay talking about how she gonna you know that's not it man that's not it and because of that our women are out of order and you know be, and you know then next thing you know these same men be talking about how to you know strong black woman next you know the black woman beating their ass and when they even when they even flinch at her you know they they they're they going to prison okay you going to prison Okay, because we in the world where women rule over the, the um the uh, men, you know. And Esau ultimately helped set it up to 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 be this way. This is Isaiah chapter three verse twelve. As for my people, children are their oppressors, and women rule over them. O my people, they which lead thee cause thee to err and destroy the way of thy paths. You see, so the the the, the children are, 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 are that are our oppressors are these Edomites. You see, because they came out of us. You see, the, the, these um, and they're oppressing us, and they oppress us, and they rule over us with our own women. You see, Eve is East is the Edomite man's lapdog, and you're starting to see a lot of these Edomite women run over to. The damn the Israelite man because in reality they see the the Edomite man losing power. They see that he's um you know on his way out. The scriptures say how their widow sh shall not pity them. Let's see if I can grab that. Let's see if I can grab that. Um. So lock your bear with me. Show. Um, because that that's that's what's coming, man. You know. And and it's the same way it was for 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 us. You know, whenever we got were brought low, you know, our women didn't pity us, man. And they don't pity us now, man, really. You know. Now you got women out there that's striving for righteousness, you know. But then you got a majority of our women that are just completely wicked. You know, completely wicked. They are completely adverse unto us. Okay. Um. You see, and ultimately, this is a. Uh, oh man, I, well, I, I guess I can't find it right now. But you, but but a a a but but, 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 but but listen, man, you get the point. All right, you get the point. And, they, and, and the black women in this country, in this world, is not the problem. Yes, they are. Because when you talk about it, you, when you talk about no, it, you talk no, about no. my black mother. No, 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 no. You talk about my, my black sister. You talk about my girlfriend. You talk about everybody. Now I don't know what's going on with your mom. No, sir. I don't know what's going on with your mom, but no, wait, I, no, wait, no. my uh, my uh, condolences to whatever's going on with your mom. <laughs> but. Uh, no, no not, I don't think no, I don't think it's ever every black woman's fault what's going on with the mom. Yeah, I'm listening. That bitch is 97 years old and she don't know how to quit. Oh, there we go. Mm. Okay. We got black chicks that are like that, okay? They need to be bring in. I'm serious. These ladies over here would love for you to join them. 
Okay. Yep. Okay. Hey, you have a nice day, okay? Now, don't get me wrong, I ain't saying the lady ain't batshit crazy, because she, 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 you know, she, she definitely is. But, you know, the point that she was, she was making there was absolutely right, you know. And, you know, this also is a part of, you know, Esau envy and, um, you know, having that hatred and that envy for, for Jacob, you know. But, but hey, but, right, but rightfully so, you know. This, this man is a sword, okay. This is the book of uh, Ecclesiasticus. Or Sirach chapter twelve, chapter like chapter twenty five, verse twenty four, of the woman came the beginning of sin, and through her we all die. And this is talking about Eve. You see, we, listen, man, if you gonna come serve the Most High and you know start trying to learn about this Bible and stuff, you are gonna have to do it in truth. All right, Lord, so you have to serve Him in truth, okay, and and, and in spirit. And we can't sit here and and and, and you know sit here and try to you know put 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 well you know pretty much push over the fact push 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 the fact under the rug that you know eve has has a large responsibility has is, is largely responsible for all of this man you know according to the scriptures you see because of 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 of, of, of her and esau okay the edomite man who which made a pact in the garden okay and it ultimately was to destroy the Israelite man. You see? That's what it often was to destroy. And this man doesn't realize that. You know, he in his own little world. And you see how the waiter came and told her that, hey, dude, this, will, this group of women over here would like you to come sit with them. And he, you know, got all excited and stuff. You know, because at the end of the day, a lot of our people, they support and, you know, get behind wickedness, man. You know? That, you know, that's why the scripture says that a strong rebuke is better than secret love because really we're supposed to rebuke our people for the wickedness that, 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 that they do. And, you know, the wickedness of a woman, scripture is talking about that. Sirach 25 verse 19, all wickedness is but little to the wickedness of a woman. Let a portion of a sinner fall upon her. And this is why you see, you know, shit, it was, a, it was um, it was a, uh, the other day it was a shootout, you know. Not too far from my house, or whatever, and it was a um, a man in a car with two women. One, um, it was a man in a car with two women and a man on the bike. And I guess, you know, the man on the bike was going to see his woman, you know, and it happened to be, you know, she happened to got picked up by another man. The man said that he is they riding past him on the bike. He ride, you know, he says, I guess he said something to him. They get in an argument, starts having a shootout, and both and both of those men are 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 now dead, and the women are were in the hospital with minor um, you know, uh, minor you know issues or whatever. Or right, uh, minor injuries, but but both of those men died, by, you know, behind those damn women, man. You see, so these wicked men ultimately that that you know sit here and try to justify the wickedness of, of the so-called black woman, hey, they, hey you're going to ultimately end up be becoming, you know, being destroyed, just destroyed with her, man. You know, that's that woman worship spirit. All right. And the Lord is not with that, man. As a man, it's time for us to step up and get things in order. You know, order has to be established among our people. You see, because if not, then, you know, all you're doing is causing the people to be destroyed, man. So our people are not corrected. Say you got a, you know, your mother, like, he, like this man said, his mother, his sister, his his girlfriend, whatever it may be. If they're not corrected, then they're going to die. If you don't correct them, you're going to die. Okay? And that blood is going to be on, on your hands. So, see, what, 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 what we're saying here is ultimately for... You know your own, you know, good man. This is the book of Micah, chapter seven, verse nine. I will bear the indignation of Yahweh, because I have sinned against him. Until he plead my cause and execute judgment for me, he will bring me forth to the light, and I shall behold his righteousness. And this is what's happened. You know, ultimately, our woman being against us and being out of order is because we sin against the the, the, the Most High. You know, at the end of the day. 
And right now we because we're coming coming back to the most high. And what his he she um he will bring his um bring me forth to the light, which is what is truth, and I shall behold his righteousness. You know, they, they, they have this understanding. Verse 10. Then she that is mine enemy shall see it, and shame shall cover her, which said unto me, Where is the where is Yahweh thy power? Mine eyes shall my like it, mine eyes shall behold her. Now shall she be trodden down as the mire in the streets, which means destroyed, man. You know. So, you know, you we have we have we have, you know, the wicked there is, you know, wicked of our women that has to be corrected. You know, the majority man gonna be able to be corrected. But the ones that can be corrected, it's our a man's job to correct them. Okay, it's your job to, cook, to, 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 to put things in check, man. And if you don't, you're a fucking coward, a weakling, and the Lord is not dealing with you, man. We showed you a scripture that said what Lord said, what gird up thy loins like a man. Okay, you can't be, you know, trying to be this effeminate, lovey dovey, you know. Everybody best friend bullshit, man. It's time for us to gird up and it's time for us to hey, hey, to put our nation, you know, starting with the elect first and foremost. Because, hey, we understand that the, hey, the majority of these niggas, okay, ain't going to make it. They ain't going to get right. They ain't going to want to repent. So they're going to end up having to die a horrible death here. But it's our job, if we can help it, to, you know, edify as many of our people as possible, man. And that includes our women. And that right there is what real love is, man. I'm, I'm going to end off with this right here. So lock you, because a lot of a lot of jakes they 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 completely miss this in the scriptures, man. You know, they get emotional. A lot of emotion in Israel, man. Proverbs chapter twenty seven, verse five: Open rebuke is better than secret love. You see, faithful are the wounds of a friend, but the kisses of an enemy are deceitful. You see. But the, the, the point was open rebuke is better than secret love. So it's our job to is to openly rebuke our, you know, the, 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 the you know, our nation, you know, l l let them know what the wrong from the rights. And that way, you know, we get closer to the most high and ultimately get the hell up out of here, man. You see, and this woman might not even be a be, be an Edomite, man. You know, she she could be a Jake. You know, she 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 could be the southern kingdom, a southern kingdom woman, you know. So, hey, it's time to wake up, man. But I ain't going to make this too long. I want to say, call Halal, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Makakadash, give me the spirit to do this lesson. Um, Shalom to anybody um, that may be watching this lesson. Okay. Kwame Asharala. Um, peace and citations to the whole four legs scattered abroad. And with that being said, I'm going to say Shalom.